What's up, people? Hope everybody's good. Um, just come back uh, from work, just uh, filming a couple of videos. Um, picked these up at G-Shock East at the collector's meet last week. Um, so there's two watches here, uh, but I'll, I'll do them in separate videos. So keep some time up. So the first one we have is the GA400 7AER. So let's crack this out. This is um, a new a new model release, pretty pretty cool, um, and when I open it you'll see why, um, and I'm going to show you quickly one of the features, um, I don't normally run through features in videos, but um, I think this one this one really deserves it. So, I went with the, uh, the white, and uh, here she is, really really nice, um, the sun's shining through behind me, so you can see the white and the black, the screen, um, and you notice here you've got one small digit and then the minutes are bigger. Um, not sure why they've done that, maybe just to make the minutes easier to read um, or whatever. Maybe they've done it so uh, just adds a bit of a different style, but no, nah, it's cool. So here's your tag, GA4078ER, standard G-Shock, you got all the standard stuff with it. Um, also something different which they haven't done before, they've cut the corner of the strap. Um, I think that means um, when you feed it through into the keeper, um, it kind of finds its way in a little bit better. So it's... It does find its way in a little bit better. Um, not sure it was necessary, but you know why not? On these, you've actually got a plastic buckle, which is a lot bigger than the uh, buckle on the standard, on the GA one tens and the uh, GD one hundreds. So it's quite a big buckle. So doesn't say G-Shock on, like some of them do. Uh, and then basically, it's pretty pretty simple. All white back plate. Okay, that's focused GA400. Um, so if we go into the adjust, and you hold it down, and then if you want to scroll through the series, you just scroll the wheel and you hear it click. So if we choose that one, it will scroll back, and then if we want to Hold it again, London, and it will set back to London. So that is basically it. Yeah, I just wanted to show you that quick function. That wheel on the side, it's a pretty cool wheel. Um, it's used for a few different features, so you've got the timer feature. So when you when you do that, you can set your countdown timer. Press the side button, and it starts counting down. Can you add to it? You can't add to it. Um, adjust, nope. So yeah, you can scroll through the modes. It's it's a cool watch. I haven't fully, I haven't had a proper play with it. Um, I only really wear watches because I like them because they look cool and to tell the time. I don't really use them for anything else. You might tell in my videos. I never go through the settings or anything because um, I'm a watch collector. Uh, I wear them. Yeah, I do. But I look down. I look at the time, see what time it is, and that's about it. We're only undefeated today. Got a review on that. Um, cool piece. So yeah. Hope you enjoyed my review of the uh, GA400, um, and I hope you guys managed to score one if that's what you're after. Peace out, thank you very much.